So, day two of TDC. We're just down here in the shop. Gary, the master mechanic, helped me fix my front wheel. So hopefully that's not dragging, and that was not fun yesterday. Uh, a few little minor tweaks, but pretty much the same setup. Everyone's getting ready to go. Also, we're in our kit today, so that's super exciting. Haha, bonjour mon ami et mon amis. Today we are going to go to the famous historical town of La Honne, where we will try and find a little bit of lunch, maybe a baguette, maybe a beer, and maybe some other things. So here we are, day two of Tour de Chateau. I'll meet in front. The weather's perfect once again. Today's 91 Ks, we're riding to the town of Leon. It's like a very medieval type town, I guess. These are our fellow road users. The problem with this is it's like a fortified city. It's up on a hill. So <laughs> I'm taking it easy because I'm expecting a bit of a tough climb. This particular road we've come through before last year and it was just as good, it's absolutely amazing. The weather and the cycling here. Back home in Australia, this road to be gravel, which suits me, but it's just amazing how much decent road infrastructure they maintain here. It's really brilliant. I don't know if the scale of these wind farms comes out on the video, but something really cool about riding here is seeing them in action. Tell me your English without saying your English. <laughs> so this is a behind the scenes clip of the level of effort we go to to make sure you at home see beautiful photography. There's been, there's been backtracking, adjusting. These poppies weren't here yesterday. Shard actually had them flown in from another part of France. Persia. Persia. He's a Persian poppy. We invented them. Opium. Opium. Mexican opium. <laughs> He thinks I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> well, on a serious note, guys, uh, lovely day today. Nice to see everybody in the kit, uh, designed by a friend uh, back in Sydney. Um, and yes, we're in the poppy fields of France, where a lot of the fatalities took place in the First World War. So there's a lot of uh, context. It's been a beautiful day of riding, amazing hills, uh, good mates, everyone's in good spirits. GPS's are kind of working. It's all good. What's amazing is that they protect cyclists so well. This is the armed escort that Shard's organized for us this week, just to make sure that we are safe on the roads. There's uh, tanks, uh, some trucks to carry our gel, that the truck carrying our gel. Uh, this gentleman here is just making sure that we uh, have no problems with anyone on the road. It's really quite impressive what Shard's pulled off once again here. sits so far above the rest of the landscape for like half an hour you're cycling towards it with clear view it's it's a real experience
Midrai check-in. Hi. Hi. So we came here last year. Yes. But we came to a concert, we drove. Yes. And it felt far then. But the ride in this morning was good. I don't even know how many kilometers we've done. What have we oh, done? 40, 45? It yeah. didn't even feel like that. It didn't feel like 45. Yeah. So good, good weather, good roads. I only got yelled at by one French uh, driver. Yes. And we're not sure if we deserved it or not. So we'll reserve judgment. Yes. You know? So things are, uh, things are looking pretty good. So this town is a medieval town. Yes. What, what, what does that even mean? Well, the cathedral was built around the 1100s. Uh, so that's what medieval means in this part of the world. Uh, it's a fortified town. Uh, so it was designed both as a center of worship and a place to keep the marauders away from the Gentile people. I think marauders is just bad news. Yep. Bad news. Everywhere. Yeah, bad news. So we just picked just a little, I wouldn't even describe this place, it's like a pizza kebab sandwich shop. Yes. Uh, having a Dr. Pepper. Uh, not everyone likes Dr. Pepper. I don't know what's wrong with them. It's brilliant. Dr. Pepper is awesome. It's brilliant. It's good stuff. Uh, so basically we ride home from here. That's uh, it. You know, it's a, a nice ride back. There's a couple of little just slow climbs which uh, will tickle the legs on the back end of this. But again, the riding here is just pleasant. You know? We have lots of open roads, open fields, almost no cars until we get closer to land. So it was just really very pleasant. And uh, just, you can see why they breed world champions here. Yeah. Yeah, it's really visible. Even the cars, like the cars and trucks, like they give you so much room and, and they're really courteous and, and they're really friendly. It's just such a good place to ride and to just have a good day out. So yeah, yeah. thanks for uh, bringing us here, buddy. Thanks for coming. That's the most important part. Hello, all chaps and all chapesses. We have made it to this wonderful vista. And out there, you can see where we come from. If you look into the distance, you will see windmills. The modern sort that Don Quixote went after. And we've come from there, here we are.